was on my way out this way, wasn't yeah, I? Yeah, 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 that's it. And it's gonna try to do like a, oh, look how dramatic it is that you're entering the world light thing, but it looks kind of corny. Watch. Alright, let's just, let's see this. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, man, this is so bright. Oh, yeah, this is the DLC missions, side missions. Oh. You don't have to go to them yet. I recommend you do not go to them right now. You will get your, your shit pushed and... Okay, so all of those things that just appeared yeah. were like... Also, uh, because don't turn your radio on, we're probably going to get content flagged. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah, it's too bad. The music's pretty good. Um, that's that's like good. one of the main draws yeah, for the series yeah, in general for me. Yeah, but, uh, you know, you know. I'll just that's how the think YouTube about work. setting the world on fire. No, that's Fallout 3. Oh, God This damn game it. has tons of cowboy music. Oh, God I know, I know, yeah, yeah. God it has it. it has a theme song from one of my favorite westerns ever, um, Johnny Guitar. Oh, and it just plays damn. every once in a while. I'm like, this song's great. People hate the song, like apparently online, but I fucking love it. So grand they can fuck off. Sierra but... Madre Casino. I know what Johnny Guitar sounds like. Yeah, and I love, and that that's one of the songs I could play. But that's too bad. Yeah, no Your well. level cap has been raised by five. Yeah, so this is fine. All the all the DLC did is make it. Cause your level cap used to be twenty, I think. Uh -huh. After all the DLC, I think it's forty. Is I this, could be wrong. Is, is this Victor? That is indeed Victor. Howdy, partner. Might I say you? He's a friendly cowboy. As a fiddle. Why, well, thank you. Thanks for digging me out. See, and if see if you saw the go down all the way down. Uh huh. I've never seen a robot like you before. If you saw the cutscene, uh -huh. you would have. Oh, really? And it would have kind of ruined this experience. You've never seen anything like this before, right? All so right. you can genuinely say, I've never seen a robot like you before, you know? Right. Well, like, ostensibly, do you have amnesia in this, in, like, does my character have amnesia right now? It's interesting. It's like, you kind of do, but later on, he talks about stuff, your character mentions, oh, I remember that from Reno. Bah. Yeah, so, like, he has some memory. So it's really weird. It's either that or bad writing. <laughs> All right, uh, let's just go with that then. I've never seen a robot. I'm Securitron. Robco Security Model 2060B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. How come you talk in a southern drawl? Because he's a southern boy. It's a robot. Southern bot. All right, well, thanks for digging me out of that oh, grave. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. Hey, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm a stranger. How'd you happen to find me? I was me? out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Well, that's mighty kind of you. Do okay, you know one other detail I forgot to tell you. Benny is this guy. He's got... He looks like, like a Las Vegas mobster. He's in like a white suit. Oh, okay. So keep that in mind as an image of Benny. Because right. they'll, they'll start talking about stuff like that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so... Generally speaking, with all these dialogue choices, is it like mostly flavor text that gives me story? Yeah, and I, I think because you didn't see the cutscenes, uh -huh. these actually have value. Hmm, okay. So... It behooves me to listen to everything they have to say, at least for now. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town not be able to help you out with that. All right, how'd you end up I'm here? I was in town, oh, 10, 15 years ago. Before that, I... Um, I can't quite seem to recall. Odd. It's a mystery. Anyway. It's a right peaceful mm. town, and I reckon it's as fine a place to settle as any. Luke Skywalker probably wiped his memory banks. <laughs> All right, goodbye. Happy trails. This is a prequel movie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on Tatooine We're right now. We're on Tatooine. Good Spring City and Tatooine. They all talk in a southern drawl on the southern side of Tatooine. Okay, so... You just, you just go about town talking to people. See, you see, okay, at the lower left corner, mm -hmm. that's your compass. See that compass? Yes. That marker tells you where your next thing is to go. Okay. So it's a little helpful there. Um, and also, if you bring up your Pip-Boy, which is your tab button. 
hit tab, bam, look at all these things. Oh, okay. So you got your CN conditions. Condition, so radiation? Can, yeah, so it's got to just, you know, go, yeah. And uh, that tells you what effects are happening. Okay. So plus two speech, plus melee, because of your vault jumpsuit. Mm -hmm. um, you can check out your special. Yeah, so it's telling you what's going mm -hmm, on. Mm -hmm. Your skills, perks. Perks are like completely separate things that can help you out, which is what you chose, right? Right. Yeah, so um, general, I'm not sure what's going to be in here yet. Hmm. So we'll see. Um, you can check out your items. Just click on the I button. Yeah. Whoa. All weapons fall under weapon skill gather determines how effective the weapon is. Guns, blah, blah, blah. Compare the small icon below to the left of the weapon's icon. The icon shown on the boy skill menu. Damn DPS. He's in Damn base DPS. damage and damage per second. Weapons with low damage have difficulty penetrating armor. If you hit a target's damage threshold, switch to a weapon with a higher dam or use Yeah, so Fallout New Vegas' damage calculation is way more lenient. Hmm. So what happened? This is why it's an easier game. So if Fallout Three, it's damage resistance. So depending on the number, mm -hmm. that's just the percentage it lowers the damage by, right? Okay. Damage threshold is if the damage doesn't go above that number, you won't even get damaged. Okay. And whatever is above that number, it's just subtracted from it. Okay. So so if, so if your damage threshold is twenty and the guy is shooting you for twenty five, you only take five. All right. So this is Paper Mario rules. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is Paper Mario and be, rules. And that's why it's a much easier game because okay. you just, you just got to max out your damage threshold. In Fallout Three, you'll always take damage no matter what. Hmm. Okay. You know? All right, so and, and, and that would imply that I too have a damage threshold. Yes. So okay. So if someone like some weak ass enemy tries to come at me with something that is below my damage threshold, I will not get damaged at all. I think you might get like one. Hmm. You know, I think you always get. Actually, I was wrong. You might get like a little bit, but yeah, I mean, it, it, but the game is a lot easier as a result. Like there's a lot you have less you have to really worry about. Okay. Um, condition affects the amount of damage it does. Yeah, this is defense. like what Breath of the Wild. Okay, only needs to be maintained. But unlike Breath of the Wild, you can repair your weapons. That's pretty good. You just That's to... something I wish Breath of the Wild had. Yeah, all you gotta do is press repair and then combine two of the same weapon. Oh, later really? on, yeah, okay. and then it'll just take parts from the other one and repair whatever. That's uh, kind of a dumb thing because yeah. it's in all likelihood the same part of both weapons is worn out. Listen, listen, you shut your <laughs> fucking mouth. <laughs> okay, but but, but later you can get a perk called jury rigging. Jury rigging lets you use any weapons within the same class. Oh, that's kind of neat. Yeah, so that, that, that makes almost That almost makes it sound better. Like that almost more, makes more sense. Yeah, exactly. Too. That's what I'm saying. It's like, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. So, that's your, so the weather 10 millimeter pistol is an excellent weapon to start out with. Okay. Yeah, so I would have that equipped. All right. And, and me clicking it there just equipped yeah, it? Yeah, now you have it equipped. All right. Um, you can also set uh, quick equips, but I honestly don't know how to do that for PC. I'll be honest. I've never done it. Those, These are the radios. Don't turn them on. All Every single one of them is licensed music? Uh, Radio New Vegas is a licensed music. The other ones are broadcasts to get you to go to a DLC mission. Oh, right, right, right. yeah. So yeah, I would not worry about them. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All right. So wait, and then there's one other thing. What? Uh, local map, world map. Oh, okay. So this is your local map. This helps you get around if you're lost within a local area. Mm -hmm. It tells you where the entrances and exits are. Mm -hmm. A world map is what you're going to be using the most. So look at the world map. See, and you can just zoom out with the mouse wheel. Oh, okay. So Fallout New Vegas is actually smaller than Fallout Three. Like this is the whole world map here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So. Uh, it looks like there's not a lot, but that's because most locations you haven't discovered yet. Right. Um, and once it fills out, it's nuts how many things are in this little map. Uh, I believe it. Yeah, and then so you have quests as well. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of these are DLC quests. Um, uh, but what you want... So Day Went That Away is for the, ver for the beginning of your game, your main mission. You're trying to find Benny and fucking kill him. Okay. Or deal with him however you feel is appropriate. Um, back in the saddle is the your tutorial, right? Yeah. Um, so there's miscellaneous. I forget what's miscellaneous. Mm. Oh, it's your notes and recordings and stuff. Record Audio package, logs. Yeah. Bonus on completion. Manifest. Contract penalties. Huh, all right. Yeah. So it's a. It's a. This is a very Western RPG. There's lots of menus. Yeah. It's a little convoluted. There's lots of things to look at. You gotta take your time. 
Yeah, it's it. This is all new to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is this is very. It's like very different from like a like a JRPG, right? JRPGs is like, yeah, it's you got like, your stats. That's it. Yep. Yeah. So, so like, what do you what do you got equipped? That's everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Um, and like you, you move through the menu very quickly, grabbing things and shit. But the Western RPGs are a lot more like tactical. Yeah. It's like football, American football versus other shit. Versus <laughs> Japanese football. Versus the Japanese football. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Uh, so you gotta find Sunny Smiles. So we follow the marker. Right. So I think you gotta go in the saloon. Oh. Yeah, in typical Western fashion. That's one thing oh, I really right, like right, about right. the flavor of this game. It is a post-apocalyptic Western. Yeah. And really, it's a post-post-apocalyptic Howdy. Western. What can Easy Pete do for you? I don't know. What can you do for me? The one in the fancy suit seemed to be calling the shots. That's as much as I know. Other folks in town might know more. Word of advice, though, if you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. What's a snake? <laughs> I forgot literally everything. Well, post apocalyptic Oh, you're right. <laughs> it's like a, probably like a rad <laughs> snake. I wonder what they, a snake would be. Yeah. I don't know. Because all the animals are fucked up in this world. Wait, he just said he was a prospector, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Gold! Nah, nah. Means I poked through old buildings. Oh, you imposter. <laughs> Some folks just call it salvage. That's a scout. I'd never like the term. The way I see it, salvage means it's broken, near worthless. Me, I look for the good stuff. Guns, chems, spare parts. Good money in it. And hillbillies prefer to be called Sons of the South. That don't mean it's gonna happen. Alright, did you ever find anything good? What's wrong with the NCR? Okay. Nope. Had a pretty good claim once, way out east by the river, but got run off by raiders. Eventually got too old to keep going out. Don't get me wrong, the NCR's got a lot of decent folk in it. It's just that they make you part of them, whether you like it or not. Towns like Good Springs and Prim don't stay independent for long. Not if you've got something the NCR wants. Still, the NCR keeps the Legion away. What's the Legion? Yeah. They're slavers, led by a guy named Caesar, or Kaisar. <laughs> not sure how you're supposed to say it. A couple of years ago, they tried to take over Hoover Dam, but the NCR beat them back. The NCR didn't or couldn't finish the job, though. Wait. The Legion's got its strength back and is getting ready for another round at the dam. My money's still on the NCR winning, but you never know. We've been hearing stories about Legionaries on the Nevada side of the river, so keep a gun handy. You don't want to get caught by them. See, so it's like, it, this is what I mean. This is why it's post-post-apocalypse. You know, yeah. it's like he, civilization has ended, but new ones are being made. Now, here's a question. How would you not know how to pronounce Caesar or Caesar? You'll see. They'll, it'll, the world will kind of explain why. Okay, because that would imply that he's only ever seen it written in text. No, that's not why. You'll see why. Are there two different bands of people pronouncing it different ways? Uh, okay, so I'll just explain. <laughs> so, so <laughs> normal people just say Caesar. The Legion, let's try to say it the original, like, Latin way and say Kaiser. Beh. So that's why. Because they feel very self important. All right. The damage powers a lot of New Vegas. The of New Vegas. Damn! Me too. Anybody who owns Damn! The owns the territory. Okay, is that all irradiated water? Meat and hide mostly. Can't put a pack on them. You just lay down until you take it off. <laughs> Can find this a is the bunch, bunch of chunkers. High up in the hills, but gotta be careful around them. They can put up a decent fight if cornered. The machine, harmless. No matter what Trudy says. Who's Trudy? She thinks it's high. Oh, he'll say. But I think it's just a broken down relic with no place to be. Well, that's just sad. Keep Goodbye. Gun handy if you go poking around some of the abandoned places around here. Like the schoolhouse. Critters move in there sometimes. Well, Fucking I'll school. be. 
a school's diagnosis. I don't think I'm ever going to get used to the way it just zooms the hell in on a person when you talk it's to a little, them. It's a little, it's a little, yeah. There's sometimes... Like I, f- I feel like I'm just leaning into their face. <laughs> There's sometimes where it's really dramatic, like it's across the room. Wait, I can sit. Yeah, you can just take a load off if you want. And uh, roll your mouse wheel back. More, keep rolling. Keep rolling. Okay, I had to like kind of get away from yeah, it. Yeah, and then uh, click your mouse button to the middle one. And just kind of, oh, sorry. You can kind of rotate the camera around. Yeah. Okay. See, that's how you look. Well, I had enough of setting for a spell. Oh, Let's no, now inside. you're third person the whole time. Oh, is. You just, you just roll your mouse wheel back in. Okay. Ugh. 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 <laughs> Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Where's Cheyenne? This is, you got Doug. She got Doug. Oh, I want to see it. Doug. Doc Mitchell said you could teach me to survive in the desert. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. How could you don't have an accent? Listen. Meet me outside. This is a this is a, a, a rich variety of people living in this. Is it because accents are perceived to make a woman less attractive? Well, I think Trudy has an accent. But is she attractive? I don't know. You could take a look at her. See. Ugh. Like go turn turn right. Wait, you can zoom back in too. The game actually looks significantly worse than their person. <laughs> Wait, where'd she go? Did she just disappear? Yeah, that? that's how people go through doors. They turn to ghosts. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's just what happens in the post-apocalypse. Wow. 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 Wonderful. There she is. Now, Hi, Shai. Oh. The bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. She will give you a gun. Oh, will she? Can I take it by talking to her? Or do I need to use my current weapon? Oh, you have your current weapon now, so you just press. Yeah, just pull out your pull out your gun. Oh, sh- oh, you gave oh me my- a gun. Oh, jeez. Oh, and then. You- oh my God! No, 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 no. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What am I doing? Okay, uh, hold hold your left mouse. Ma- uh, right click. Bam. Okay. Oh, I still missed. Dan. Wait, what am I doing wrong? That's the right idea. Dan. Okay, I need to aim a little lower than I thought. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Crouch is control. Okay, that's... No shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Maybe yeah, I did. did. Maybe you did. I gotta go chase geckos away from my water supply anyway. Geckos? Brown critters are attracted mm-hmm. to it. Why don't you come It's along? a Metal Gear crossover thing. No, don't do that. I think you actually could, could help. This will teach you vats. Okay, I'm in. Idiot. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. Because Vats is the way you're going to actually want to fight. See, but you notice how it, I was just joshing you. Like, you notice how the bullets actually weren't super accurate? Yeah. That's Embryo. Gamebryo engine. Hmm. It's, uh, it's a janky This dog is jank. The game is jank. Look at them. Look at them go. Look at them all. <laughs> look, at, look at this majestic creature galloping slow, away. Slow jank gallops. <laughs> But look at her! Look at her! Look We're at her. doing look, it! Look at her! But that's Gamebryo! This is the Gamebryo engine! We're doing it! And it's it. fine! It's functional! You know? And this is, you know, this is kind of true to the spirit of Western RPGs, right? They, yeah. they were kind of not really about the looks. They were more about the functionality. Yeah. Alright. Oh, you yep. might want to switch to your weathered mil- auto gun. Uh, 10, 10 millimeter, by the way. Just press your, your, your Pip-Boy. And you go to your items. Oh, is that the only way to do that? Yeah. There, oh. There is a way to hotkey your thing. Mm-hmm. I don't remember what it is. Maybe okay. later we'll figure it out. But I don't know. Is there a run button? There, you are running. Okay. I think. Or no, pre- press shift. No, that, that's walk. Oh, when you put your gun away, you run faster. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah, yeah. We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. Vital? Yeah, so this is your sneak mechanic. So, so, so see at the top, see how it says detected? Uh-huh. But, okay. but it's yellow, which means it's okay. allies were the ones who detect. Now you're completely hidden. Okay. Um, and then if enemy si- gets a little side of you... It'll go into caution mode, and then when they really see you, it'll say danger. 
Mm. So that's how it works. So did, you're, you're only detected by them, so it's fine. You can, you can sneak forward. And then um, you should be able to start seeing them eventually when you keep going. You don't have to worry. They're just geckos. Don't worry about them. Just little geckos. Well, where are they? You'll see. They're just little geckos. Little guys. See the red dots in your compass? That's it. Oh, they found you. Oh, jeez. Press V. Press V. Press V. Okay, you didn't press V. That's fine. <laughs> I just wanted them gone. Just wanted them gone. Just wanted them gone. 